Okay, so I am going to show you how I normally, usually, every day, do my updo. Real simple. Gather all my hair on top of my head and put my band on. And then I'm going to show you how I'm going to recreate another YouTuber's updo. That's it. And I put flowers in it. So, only thing I did, bring it around once, bring it around twice, but the second time I don't bring it all the way through, all the way to the edge though, and fan it out. I like to usually put some type of ornament right there in the middle, put some decorative clippies on the side or something like that. So this has been my everyday style. I recently just saw a video of Chanel, someone I watch on YouTube. She does a lot of um, hauls and makeup tutorials, but she currently has her hair in box braids. And um, so she just section to section on each side. And she called it the Egyptian crisscross twist. And I'm going to do mine just a little bit different than hers. But I'm going to leave her channel information because I want you to check hers out. Her box braids are so pretty. Very, very neat. Unlike my, unlike my twist, I literally threw these twists in. But I have been working them out because I'm going on week three. I'm going to bring that forward. Now I'm going to first show you how she did it. She brings it all the way through and then she separates it and makes two twists. And both of these, this way is good too, but I'm going to show you how I just kind of made it slightly different. So she has the two twists and then she twists them around and made a bun like that. Used her pins and that was her bun, okay? The only thing different that I'm going to do and that I've, I've been doing last day or two that I saw her video is I still do my like I do my updo anyway bring it through the second time only all the way to the end not pulling it all the way through fan it out and I have to kind of like pin some that stick out just like that only difference take these sides get them all kind of even going to the right direction and bring them to the front Definitely need some hair pins for this because my hair is curled on the end, so it some of the curls will pop up, pop back, you know. Take the other side, even. I need to wash my hair and then crisscross it in the front. That is super cute to me, and I'm glad I saw her video. This gives me another option. Just, this, just a different look. Is that cute or what? And then one was hanging. And it's real easy just to wrap it around. To tuck it in somewhere. I can even put my flower, my decorations in the back. Super duper cute. I love it. Alright, I'm going to put on a little bit of makeup today. Not much. I'm sweating already, but I just wanted to show y'all that updo. And if I decide to decorate it, I'll come back and show you. Bye. Okay, so I took it down just to do it a little tighter. It wasn't tight. But then when I brought this one over, I, this one still needs to go over, but I actually kind of like it like this too. So I just created another style. Um... 
I think it's really cute. But I'm going to go ahead and bring this one back over. So I really, really like this. It's crisscross. Nice and snug. I like that. And then I just have like these artificial silk flowers that I just got from like the dollar store. You know they have like a whole bunch of them. And then I use these sometimes to pin in my hair. And I'm wearing my Ruby Woo bright red lipstick. So I'm going to wear this bright red flower. I got to figure out the placement for it. Because I don't have the center available anymore. And surely we can't just do it like that. Hold on, y'all. Maybe just off to the side. I might just have to pin it instead of trying to stick it in there. I might have to just pin it on like that. That's cute. There we go. So I think that is super cute. I'm sweating as usual. And I just have on this really, really cute shirt that was recently given, given to me. And I did haul it last week. So I'll try and include pictures of my whole outfit. Check the link below for Chanel's channel and see her um, beautiful updo of the Egyptian crisscross goddess. Bye guys.